Hello, in this video, I will like show you how to upgrade this 5.7 inch Hitachi screen from one CCFL to a UB35 series LED kit. This kit comes with one LED strip, one 16 pigtails, one MS610 UB LED drivers. Okay, let's take a look, set aside the kit, take a look at the screen. It's Hitachi SX14Q006. First thing we had to straighten up this clips, all size. Okay, so one, two, three, four, six, seven, eight, nine. Don't forget there's two more. So this two more is a little bit tricky, you see, if there's a solder on it. Okay, so we need to desolder it and bend it. Okay, so let me do this and then I can. So I desolder this two pins and then bend it straight. So just like this one. Then we do, we're gonna remove this, the metal film out. Okay, it's coming out. Uh, somewhere, it was holding. What happened to here? Nothing here until fun. So let me try again. There we go. It's coming out. Oh, I see, this, this sticker. Okay, just be careful, okay? don't, you don't want to damage the saddle. So now it's... Okay. Take it out, leave it the glass. Uh, here, uh, just here, it's fine. The lamp, I need to... I need to reuse this one. The lamp looks like it's still on. Oh, I see, you see this click here? So you gotta remove from this end. Remove this end. Uh, okay, here we go. You see this end? You remove this end first and then tilt up like this. Now, here we go. You see the lamp here? Okay. So the lamps here, they use a special shit to make the refreshing better. So it's, we had to remove this shit. See what happened. Uh, the tip it. Blade. The glue was there. I just finally cut through. You see this lamp? Wow, no wonder we can see the picture. Just look at this lamp. It's really bad. See this end? It's completely dark on both ends. So the lamp is bad. Anyway, in this case, we don't care. We just want to upgrade LED anyway. So we're going to put it at the same location. Yeah, perfect. So we're going to remove the lamp. Oh, oh, they have, okay, take it out, and then let me see here, let me uh, try to measure it. Looks like it's perfect, you see? Yeah. But, we're gonna probably, I don't want to use this one, I might want to use others, aluminum foil to tip it right back. Here's what I'm gonna mount. I'm gonna take this one out, you see this? I'm gonna cut off this assistant a little bit here. See this? All right, cut off a little bit. Yeah, we don't need this. And then I'm gonna mount it here. <coughs> I'm gonna add aluminum toy for it just to cover the lights, make it a little bit more efficiency. So I'm gonna mount it here. Looks let me cut it here. Okay. Just like that, and then I'm gonna add a piece of uh, aluminum to push this one up against the plexiglass. Okay, so I just cut it like this. Okay. Show you. That way is much more efficiency. Like, see, perfect. So that way, I'm gonna come the wire from this side. Uh, oops. Here and here. Okay, show you. Then I'm gonna add the aluminum foil just from here. I think this is good enough. Okay. I 
I don't want to put on this side because it may not have a problem to fit in. So I just want to make sure it. Uh, Okay, now we're gonna put it back the uh, aluminum foil. So we're gonna put the light. Let me see here. Yeah, the clip is here. Like this. This end first. Left swipe back. See, perfect on this end. Okay. Now we're gonna get this one here. Ah, over here. All right, just, just put it right back. It's in. The next thing, I'm gonna bend all the clips and solder this two. So I just bent, put those clips bent back to the normal position and then I solder this too. See? Easy. This one you can connect to either end and this is just connect to black to uh, ground or negative, uh, white to 12 volt or 24 volt. That's it. Thank you for watching.